Princess Anaya walk in the Sahal Garden alone, feeling a surge of emotions in her heart. She had just learned that she had a big sister named Sabina, who had been living in the Ingla Kingdom since she was a baby. Her parents had finally told her about Sabina and said she was coming back to Sahal soon. They explained that they had to send Sabina away for her safety because of a war that had threatened the Sahal Empire. They said they had always loved Sabina and had been waiting for the right time to reunite the family. Anaya wondered how Sabina looked like if she had the same brown hair and hazel eyes as her or if she had adopted some features from the Ingla people. She wondered if Sabina knew about her, if she was excited to meet her, if she loved her as a sibling. She wondered if Sabina had a good life in Ingla, if she had friends, hobbies, and dreams. Anaya felt a mix of curiosity, excitement, joy, and gratitude. She was happy to have a big sister, to have someone to share her life with, to have a new friend. She was thankful to her parents for protecting Sabina, for telling her the truth, for bringing them together. She was eager to meet Sabina, to hug her, to talk to her, to make up for the lost years. The Sahal Garden was usually a place of peace and beauty, where Anaya liked to spend her time reading, painting, or playing with her with her pet bird. Today, it seems to reflect her inner happiness. The flowers were blooming, the leaves were dancing, the wind was whispering, and the sky was brightening. Anaya felt a warmth in the air and the rainbow was shining in the horizon. She thought this was a sign of good things to come and a symbol of hope. She decided to write a poem to express her feelings and to send it to Sabina as a way of introducing herself. She hoped that Sabina would like it and that it would help them bond. She took out a piece of paper and a pen and wrote, Sister, I never knew you existed until today when they told me the truth that you were born before me but sent away to a friendly land when you grew up with me. Sister, I wonder how you lived your life. Did you have friends? Did you have fun? Did you have dreams? Did you ever think of me? Did you ever miss me? Did you ever love me? Did you ever thank them? Did you ever forgive them? Did you ever bless me? Sister, I want to know you better. To see your face, to hear your voice, to feel your touch, to share with you my joys, my sorrows, my secrets. To be with you as a sister, as friends, as family. Sister, I hope you feel the same way, that you are curious, that you are eager, that you are kind, that you are willing to give me a chance to trust me, to love me, that you are ready to meet me, to hug me, to talk to me. Sister, I'm waiting for you in the Sahal Garden, where the flowers bloom, where the birds sing, where the sun shines, where I hope we can start a new chapter of our story, of our lives, of our sisterhood.